Hello everyone, this is Tom Morley from FOSS 365. We've got another video on Godot, and Godot 3.0 has been released, so I'm pretty excited about this one. So I'm going to do a quick video on how to get the engine up and running on my Ubuntu Studio, okay, so that we can start doing some 3D projects. So the first thing we need to do is go to the website, type it in there, and there it is. Looks like the website has had a facelift. Looks really nice. Let's go to the download section. There's a few things I know I need. I need the game engine itself. So I'll download the 64-bit version of that. I also need the export template so that I can export it after I'm done. So that looks like it's 295 megs. So I'll speed this up so you guys don't have to wait for this that to download. Okay, looks like we've finished. And now we need to download at least one demo so that we have something to test out with the install when we're done. So let's go ahead and go to the second tab and what I'm looking for is the 3D material tester demo and we'll download that. That shouldn't take as long. Yep. That's moving right along there. Okay so we have all th three of the files downloaded and complete. Um, looks like I might have downloaded the game engine twice. Don't need to do that. So let's go ahead and minimize this. I'm going to open up another window here. And in my home directory, I've created an apps folder where I put all of my apps. Like I have Blender 2.79 in here. This is where I'm going to put my Godot game engine. So create a folder named Godot go into that folder and I may use the older version of Godot 2.x as well so I'm going to create another folder and name this 3.x and open that and I'm going to right click cut my Godot engine out paste it in here then I'm going to extract it there and get rid of that I don't need it anymore and I'm gonna go back to my home directory and I have a projects folder and that's where I put all my projects from the different applications so I need to create another folder for my Godot projects and in there I'm going to put the 3D material and um, yeah, I'll leave these here for right now. I'm going to extract those here. I'm going to delete that because I don't need it anymore. I'm going to go back to my home directory. I'm going to go back to where I put the Godot game engine and for now I'm just going to drag and drop the export template file into the same folder as my Godot engine. All right. So now all I need to do is double click and run this and it pops up. I don't have any projects in here so it's asking me if I want to open the asset library to pull some things in. I don't. I've got a demo. So let's click on import and import that demo we downloaded. So click browse and I know it's in my projects folder in my Godot material and there's the project Godot. Double click on that and import it. And it looks like it's going to import all my assets. So I might speed this part of it up until it's done importing the assets. Okay, so it just finished importing all the assets and uh, I'm in the 3D view. So let me start up my 
key monitor here so you can see that I'm using the middle mouse button to kind of zoom in and out and if I click with the middle mouse button um, I can move around so if I hold the shift key I should be able to slide things yeah so it works just like it did in 2.0 but man does it look so much better the 3d render it looks so much better it's crazy all right so what happens if we press play let's take a look at this okay so that's Godot 3.0 running and it looks like we can kind of press the next button to go through all of the different materials that uh, are in this scene and it really does look gorgeous they did an awesome job with this new 3d engine so looks like we're set up and ready to go um, with the exception of importing the export templates so we could close that let's go ahead and do that so we want to import our export templates click on editor manage export templates it's telling us it's missing we could hit the download button but we've already downloaded them so we'll install from a file it looks like it's already put us in the full material testers folder so we have to go up a couple to my home location and then I want to go into apps Godot, Godot 3.0 and there are my export templates so just double click on them and it will import the file okay so it just finished the installation and you can see here that I've got 3.0 stable export templates installed so everything looks good so we're just gonna close that so we're ready to go so we're all set up I'm excited hopefully you guys are excited if you are don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe because we're gonna do some 3d games with Godot 3.0 alright see you in the next one